Welcome to Volume 4 of our Mini Mill series. In case you're joining us for the first time, my name is Lex, and today we're going to be discussing and demonstrating some of the really neat stuff you can do with a boring head on the Mini Mill. The boring head, of course, can bore precision holes in a wide variety of materials and hold very close tolerances while doing so. We're going to show you some steps to enable you to do that quickly and easily and point out some of the pitfalls that could ruin your efforts. But the boring head has other uses than just making holes and bores bigger. Because of its design and its structural rigidity, we can bore partial holes in materials. In other words, we can cut arcs and saddles into our workpieces. This will enable us to make useful and very accurate parts. Again, before we begin, I would like to ask you to please take a few minutes and watch the safety section. Now, if you've been following this series from the beginning, I'm sure you're more than familiar with it. You're probably using sock puppets to mimic me as I go through my spiel. And that's fine, really. Whatever it takes, please just do it. The more times you go over that material, the better the odds are that it'll keep you thinking in a safety-first manner. We can't keep you safe. Only your own good common sense will do that. We just want to kickstart that survival instinct, so to speak. We have a lot of ground to cover, so let's get to it. As always, we at Swarfrat want to thank you for purchasing this presentation, and we wish you much happiness and success in your metalworking endeavors.